Welcome back to Linda's Pantry. So today I have a little different video. This is a video response to Lowbrook Prepper's one year giveaway or one year anniversary. And um, I would do this without any kind of uh, giveaway, but that's wonderful that you're so generous. Um, I would like to personally congratulate you as a fellow YouTuber uh, sticking with it for a year. It's all, it, it can be a lot of work and so to facilitate information to other people and get it out there in a clear concise manner can be a challenge sometimes and I just really do want to put out there to the people that don't do videos um, that boy it, it's a, a good thing that we have this tool and um, so I'm so appreciative of that and I appreciate all the videos that you've put up. Um, congratulations, a year is a long time. I'm coming up on that myself and uh, it, it's been a great journey. I have to say I, I love this community. I love listening or watching the chat go back and forth. Everybody's been so very positive and um, I love that. I, I try to keep a positive note in my life so um, if this wasn't a positive thing I wouldn't be here. Um, I, I guess what I've learned from other people that I watch and subscribe to, um, there's some amazing people out there and their hearts are huge and filled with generosity and um, it just makes my heart happy to see that and I've learned that instead of organizing just for my immediate family that I probably need to have the mindset of there are people maybe next door um, or in our immediate family that don't have the same mindset or don't listen or or you know don't have the resources to um, so that we might be preparing for them so when something goes on sale and I calculate how much I think I might need for six months till it goes on sale again um, I've learned that I do a little extra for those that may not be able to buy it now. And I, you know, and I used to do it six months at a time, but I think anymore we might be looking at a little further and fewer between. Um, example, last uh, May, or actually it was the end of April, when all the pork shoulders go on sale for Cinco de Mayo, and that's pretty big in this area. Um, that pork went on sale for 88 cents a pound. I canned a ton of it. and But I thought, you know, if I can enough that we would be okay for six or eight months, it'll be back on sale by Christmas. It never did go on sale like that. Um, Christmas, the cheapest I saw it was $1.19 a pound. So that's a huge eye-opener and I think what I've learned is to really look out for the good buys, pass the word along whenever possible and um, and I've just learned some different skill sets from other people here on YouTube. Um, things that I hadn't thought about canning from Cat's Cradle and uh, Bear Prepper and um, just really and truly um, grasping every bit of information and so I just want to say thank you to everybody out there that does videos because it's it's a task to facilitate and to upload and to give it in the manner in which that it's received well and um, anyways uh, low buck uh, congratulations and I wish you many many more years of YouTubing <laughs> if that's what they call it um, and uh, getting the information out there and have fun on your prepper get together you got coming up and um, anyways this is my appreciation to you for a whole year of this I wish I would have been here the whole year <laughs> alright um, I'll see you next time God bless